morning friendlings. Today is Wednesday and we are now officially three days from due date. Baby is still not moving. Um, as in she's moving, but I mean as in she's not obviously getting out anytime soon, I don't think. So today's plan is I'm going for a walk with Beck at about half one. So we're gonna see if we can get baby out, you know, with some walking. I did some walking yesterday. I went out with Ollie's mum all day and grandma all day yesterday. Um, I walked a lot, but nothing's kind of happened. My plan of action is basically to get hold of some Cla Clary Sage, I think it's called, and also some red leaf tea something like that um i haven't been using it and i feel like i probably should start considering that i want baby out so yeah so that's the plan for today so i'm gonna head into woodbridge this morning and go to holland and barrett and pick up that um i'm also thinking i might get some hold of some lavender oils i think it's lavender oils i'm gonna have to double check um someone mentioned to me that it's really good for like helping recover and helping relax in the bath things like that so that's kind of the plan uh we'll see how we get on i'm going to try and do as much as possible to try and help obviously get her out um i've been avoiding stairs for ages and apparently stairs is a really good and like really good thing to get going because it's like baby's head is hitting down onto um the pelvis so probably should do some more stairs so that's the plan yes i've said that um I might do some baking and also I really want to do some painting of our downstairs loo but I feel like that's too much but who knows what today is gonna you know entail baby is here and she's kind of kicking this morning although she hasn't been kicking lots and lots so I was worried um but she's kind of making up for it now which is good so yeah so let's head into Woodbridge it's now Quarter to nine, quarter past nine? 20 past nine. So let's get going. I've put flip flops on. It's meant to rain, but I'm thinking I'll be fine. But do you know how hard it is to put on shoes when you can't actually see your feet? And also bending down over this. It's quite hard, but I'm thinking I'll be okay. Yeah. So just been to Holland and Barrett. Ah uncomfortable and <laughs> they've run out of raspberry leaf tea i've got clary sage though so at least that's something um i'm gonna head to tesco because i've just googled it and they've got some the lady in holland and barrett said there might be some in co-op there wasn't but hey ho i'm not gonna go to tesco's and i really need a wee think of the walking though this is good for baby guess what tesco had raspberry leaf tea now, I went for the organic raspberry leaf by Clipper. Also got some of these because, you know, um, I'm going to make some, I'm going to do some baking this afternoon, I think, after I've seen Beck, or maybe before I see Beck. But yeah. Oh, what's going on with my hair? So I've just got home, and I'm going to do some baking before I see Beck at half one. Um, I don't know what it is at the moment. I just really like eating sweets and treats I think that's my problem and I like baking them um this one has been really really cute she's like really happy to see me so that's the plan of action I'm gonna see how it goes I really need to sort my hair up um so I brought some chocolate some Smarties Easter eggs and I've also got some mini eggs I thought I thought I would um, try, I'm going to try and get her in trouble. I thought I was going to, I'm, I'm going to try and do brownies again properly. Because if, um, if you guys saw my Instagram story, it didn't go exactly to plan with the cream eggs. So we shall see. Um, but yeah, so that's the kind of the plan. It's now quarter past, quarter to 11. Hello. Um, and Beck's going to be here at half one. So let's get baking. So I'm going to try this raspberry leaf tea. For the first time um it smells nice um 
I don't know whether to leave the tea bag in. I've left the tea bag in, but. Oh, it's fine. Because why is it going to be really gross? I wonder how many like cups of this I'm allowed a day. Not bad. So brownies are in. I think that they've gone a lot better than last time. Um, I've put them on a bigger tray. So hopefully it's not gonna be as bad. Um, well, it wasn't bad last time. It was just that they were really chunky, which meant that they didn't cook all the way through. So I probably had to put them on a lower heat for a longer time, but yeah, so the brownies are in. Hopefully these ones will work a lot better than the cream eggs. And then I think I might be able to get something put in there, like as in cupcakes or cake or something in beforehand. I don't know why I'm in such a baking mood. Also, my heartburn is still quite bad. So I'm trying to keep that under control. I just got my ball a little bit as well. So I probably should do that. Maybe I'll only do brownies now. Go on my ball for an hour. Have some lunch. Um, I think that's probably the best idea. And if Ollie, when Ollie watches this, he'll be like, yes, Ren, <laughs> get on the ball. I've had my raspberry leaf tea. Um, Zoe's sister, Jody, she is a week ahead of me. Um, she's now over her due date. She's been drinking raspberry leaf tea. <laughs> Uh, she just messaged me saying that she normally has to put sugar in which i'm quite surprised that i don't like everyone said to me you'll probably have to put sugar in because i've got such a sweet tooth but i've actually been okay and i really like it so i'm just gonna hope that that's the reason that um i don't need to put sugar in it and it's not the fact that i've eaten a couple of smarties eggs already but we'll see the end product i think they might be a little bit too thin so maybe i used a too big a tray but I think it looks alright. You know, I'm not trying to eat so much. Although there's more than last time. I don't know, it looks... I don't think it looks good. I think it looks alright. Who shall I see? I'm pretty chuffed, actually. So I'm currently waiting, waiting for Becca Berry. I call her Becca Berry because she's awesome at baking, by the way. So if I ever do slip up and say Becca Berry instead of Beck that is why um so she's currently on her way over so i'm closer to the hospital and hey Hello. yeah how are you <laughs> <laughs> oh, now i've got my dog walking jeans i've got holes in <laughs> literally i was like i'm waiting for bed <laughs> oh by the way where's cat oh yeah oh my god i, I literally just <laughs> Beck just said, I don't want to uh, bath him. And then he goes in that. Which. Cooper! <laughs> what is wrong with you? <laughs> I'll tell him, Daddy. <laughs> See if you haven't guessed, we're uh, in the woods. We're on the walk. <laughs> Beck legit just said to me, Oh, he, he actually listened to me. He didn't roll over when, when he was going to. And then about 30 seconds later, Beck, what did he do? He went into the water. <laughs> the muddy, muddy water. He is so filthy. He's literally half <laughs> ginger, half black. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Hey, Beck. Happy hump day. <laughs> so we just got, so I say we, um, Beck's just gone back to work. Um, We've come back from the walk. I didn't film that much, but I'm really glad that I filmed the bit I did. I cannot believe how much that Cooper got dirty. And then he did it again later on, which I didn't catch on film because accidentally um, my phone was on silent and Ollie tried to phone me and then tried to phone Beck and couldn't get through to us. So I think he thought I was kind of in labor. <laughs> Sorry, Ollie. Um, so I was speaking to him on the phone when he did it. So that was quite funny to watch. Um, I am currently sat with Clary Sage in, oh, mm, in here, 
um, sniffing up the room. I'm going to watch a couple of episodes of Modern Family because that's apparently what I'm into at the moment. Um, and then I'm going to do some more baking. I gave Beck a couple of bits of brownie and she also said to me that the cookies I did that looked like poo <laughs> were actually really good. So I'm tempted to do some of those but then put some um, chocolate eggs in them so it looks a little bit better. Because as I've told you, I'm on a bit of a cooking frenzy. And... I probably, when I watch a couple of episodes, should be on the ball, so I'm going to do that. And then I'm going to get on to some more baking. And then do Ollie's dinner, and then I'll, Ollie will be home. So that'll be Wednesday done. Um, I can't believe that it's going so quickly. Also, Clary Sage, if I'm saying it even right, um, is actually really calming for cats, which I've just read up on. So I'm really pleased that it's going to be hope helping both of us. Not that the cats have been, like, maniacs, but as in, like, calming before the baby's here. So I'm quite excited about that. But yeah, so I'm just going to get myself on that ball. baby is back to back so I'm trying to have her not back to back um, this is what my life has come to <laughs> leaning over the pregnancy ball and just rocking on my knees trying to get her to move um, I don't know if it's working but hopefully it is our midwife appointment is on Friday so hopefully when I go in there they're gonna tell me that she has moved <laughs> wish us luck <laughs> finished baking um i think i'm gonna stop now and actually prepare dinner considering it's 10 past five um ollie's gonna be home late from work so i don't need to start dinner just yet but how good do these look oh yeah i think i have a serious problem they've got uh smarty eggs inside the cookies and then they've got cadbury's um Cadbury's mini eggs on top but yeah so I think yeah I think I'm gonna leave the video here so it's another vlog we have three days three days until due date hopefully um she's gonna turn up before then uh I've got the Clary Sage still going I'm obviously gonna still be drinking the raspberry leaf tea but yeah so I will see you guys all next time I'm gonna try and get another vlog in before she's here I reckon I probably could now I've said that, I probably jinxed myself. But yeah, so I'll see you guys all next time. Bye.